And because of that flooding, several people living along creeks woke up to find their backyards had turned into a lake, including people in South Buffalo on Potter's Road. Ice jams on Casanova Creek caused water to rush hundreds of feet from the creek toward their homes. News Force Chris Servatis is live along Casanova Creek with a look at what they've been dealing with today. Chris? Hey guys, the jamming causing the Stevenson Street Bridge here to be shut down this evening. They actually shut it down a little bit after 9 this morning. The reason that ice is moved up very high and on top of it, there's some woody debris. So the concern is if that jam, which extends all the way back to the Casanova Street Bridge, breaks up, it'll all just rush in here and could be problematic for anybody who happens to be standing on it, walking on it, or driving. Now we want to show you what it looked like a little bit upstream of Casanova Creek. This is also in South Buffalo earlier on today. This is one of those backyards on Potter's Road. Check it out. Water rose just about as high as that four foot above ground swimming pool. Most of these homes were safe because they're built much higher than the backyards are, but the homeowners here aren't sure what's going to happen to everything in their shed. They're waiting for the water to go down so that they can check it out. And believe it or not, what you see here isn't even the worst of it. It was a few feet higher. You could actually hear the bubbling of the water kind of rushing in and filling up the, you know, because we get a lot of groundhogs and stuff. So it was actually like bubbling overnight. So it was actually pretty wild. Like you could actually hear kind of a hissing sound. It was, it was actually pretty cool. We also heard reports some basements in this area were flooded. The charts show that Kaz Creek did slowly go down over the course of the day today. Of course, that's great news, but it will still take some time uh, for these to dry out. And some potentially scary news, it is forecasted that Casanova Creek spikes again later in the week, maybe uh, early Friday morning. So that's something that these people are going to have on their minds. A rough week ahead, something they're used to here in South Buffalo. Reporting from Stevenson Street, Chris Horvath, it's News 4.